to do in baclofen, neurontin, mentin. I guess we can give him baclofen. What patient I gave a baclofen and then she disappeared. <laughs> so either she died or she, I thought it was she had a seizure. It's like only 10 milligrams. Ah, see, yeah. yeah. I mean, I, we can try but uh, let's the camera. Neurontin is uh, mementin is, is another new drug this We can try baclofen for him. You know, I use baclofen sometimes for neck pain and all that. Uh, does he have any underlying systemic uh, No, it's, it's uh, congenital. Congenital. Well, uh, the thing that cracks me up is somebody was following him for over 10 years, Atalal camera, and then suddenly realized this is an emergency, I should say, <laughs> to a neurosurgeon. Uh, neurosurgeon said, what? Did the CT or MI said no? He goes to your ophthalmologist. So I mean, you're following the patient over ten years, and then wake up one day and you realize, oh, this is an emergency. Initial camera still hasn't changed direction now at all. So the normal cycle is between one to two minutes. Alright, and what's the, what's the uh, uh, most underlying cause of this? I mean, he had no near near imaging. So, the patient with albinism usually, the, the albinism is important, especially if it's ocular albinism. <coughs> I'm just waiting it to gain direction. Slowing down, slowing, slowing. Is he um, also? He's high, he's beginning to be symptomatic. Now it's going to go in the other direction. See? There it goes, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. He's having problems with reading, and 